Hey guys, what's going on? This is Ray with Follow My Lead Dog Training. Your dog trainer. Listen, we got a new segment here that we're going to do with dogs called Dada and, and London. And London just got the Tooth Fairy visit for the second time. So we're on our way. All right, London. So what did you want to talk about? today with dogs. I want to talk about how they exercise. You want to talk about how they exercise? Okay, this is great. Let's talk about a couple ways that a dog can exercise. Hmm. I think that a dog can exercise by walking. Mm -hmm, what do you like that? London likes to walk the dog. Tell them how you like to walk the dog. Well, you hold the leash. And then, if you want them to stop when a car comes, pull. You pull the leash? Okay, you pull it back so they don't go towards the car. Okay, all right, that's good. That's one way to um, exercise the dog. Hmm, what's another way we can exercise our dogs? Well, we can put them on a dog working thing. Wait a minute, like a treadmill? Oh, that's a great idea. A treadmill. Now here in New England, we need this treadmill. So when it starts snowing or if it's heavy rain, we have a dog that's super active, we could put them on the, um, what's it called? I forget. <sighs> it's called the treadmill. The treadmill, okay. Hmm, let's think. Maybe I should come up with one. What about if we play with the dog? Will that help with his exercise? You sure? Like if we run around, we throw the ball, they nah. go and chase it. Like you play with Yankee. Nah, Yankee's just a little puppy, but real puppies that are big, I don't think so. You don't think the play is... is no, they just, they'll just go over, snatch your ball from your hand, and eat your hand. And eat your hand, the big dogs will do that. So, wow, that is, that is something, something impressive. Well, Daddy, maybe. All right, so we're still at dog exercise. Well, well Daddy, I was thinking if, if the dogs want to take the leash, you can just um, put them somewhere that is heavy, that you can stand, that you can put it like on, on like a leash and then, and then, and then, like, um, put it by a door so he can, so he can, like, lay down and stuff. But we're talking about dog exercise. we got to think of creative ways to yeah, get our dog I'm, exercise. I'm, I, I'm saying if they want to take a break. Oh, if, they, if we're going to take a break from exercising. Oh, taking breaks are good so the dog can get things like water. Energy. Get, get his energy renewed. Or he can just take a little nap. Take a nap. Those are all good things after the exercise happens. So that's good. All right, well, I think we I think we put it all together, guys. That was really good. Dog exercise, don't forget to walk your dog with a leash. Make sure your dog doesn't pull towards the car. And you can get a doggy treadmill. And if you see London's data, he can help you get your dog on the treadmill, right? And make sure your dog is the proper rest that it needs so that your dog can have energy and feel good about himself. Anything else you'd like to add before we go? Well, I was going to add, um, dogs can also work by exercising. They can also go on a slide, a doggy slide that can make them exercise a lot. A doggy slide. I like the doggy slides because it helps the dog build confidence when they're on the dog slide. Ha! Okay. Nice work, London. Thanks for the pro tips. All right, guys. Again, this is Ray with Follow My Lead Dog Training. Your dog trainer. Dada here. London here. London here. And we are signing off. Bye.